We have with us Shushvita Dev. She has been traveling all through the day, visiting relief camps. She has spoken to the rev victims, the the girls who were paraded naked. They have spoken to her. What they have told her, we would like to know. Shushvita, you have been traveling to relief camps. Specifically, you have spoken to the women and the children, and you have spoken to the victims of the who were naked, paraded naked. What did they say to you? First of all, the it's crystal clear that there are many more such victims. They are not the only ones. Number two, it was heartbreaking to hear her version, and she is deeply uh, shocked by the fact that all of this happened to her in front of the police. And she categorically said that if the chief minister of uh, Manipur is the home minister of Manipur. Till today, he has taken no action to find out who are these police officers. Because unless there's action on police, no one will trust the police again. So it, it made a lot of sense to me. And there's a lot of discontent with the way things are being handled by the state government. That is on both sides. We've assured her that we'll keep the pressure on the state government and the central government, the justice should be done. But it is heartbreaking because she said her brother and husband were also killed uh, by the mob and the police kept standing. When a young girl says that when I see a police personnel now in a uniform, I feel scared or it brings back those memories, that's not a good thing for any uh, law, state and its law and order given to CBI. You see, CBI... It doesn't take the CBI for a chief minister to say who are these officers in uniform who watched a rape happen, who watched a mob killing happen and did not, did not intervene. You don't need the CBI for that. A chief minister can do that. That's where her grievance is. And CBI has come and arrested the man who took the video, right? And they flashed it all over the media. You know what is the message to Manipur, what the youngsters of Manipur are telling me? Saying Amit Shah is trying to scare us, they don't take videos. They said every time there's a crime in Manipur against any community, we will take a video and the day the internet is started, we'll release each one. This is the impression they have about, you tell me, I may not know what happened, you may not know what happened till that video comes out. But are you telling me the Home Minister of India had no intelligence, intelligence report? or had no report, ground report from here, he knew he should have given CBI through two months back. Thank you. Okay, so both the sides are in pain, you know, be it in the valley, be, be it hills, that's what the opposition is saying, and she has spoken to the victim, and there the question on police is raised. This is Kumalika Sengupta with Angshu Manra reporting for CNN News 18 from Infant.